Hey y'all, welcome to Vista Acres. I'm David. And there's Maggie. Maggie's got a stick. She loves sticks. Oh me, we've been busy. I'm gonna show you kind of what I've got done this morning. And uh, I had a friend of mine come over and help me with it, which was a really good friend to give me a hand with it. And uh, we're gonna get him some wood and I'm getting some wood. Like I said, when we put the air conditioners in, uh, that, that was just a temporary deal. We're not gonna do that permanently. So, here it is. I'm gonna show y'all what we've done. All right, here we go. Been using that wood splitter. Uh, does a great, does a really, really good job. And uh, here's the wood pile. We've made uh, somewhat of a dent in it. Not a whole, whole lot, but here's where we've taken it. I've got that stack there that, uh, Got that stacked up, and then I've got some stacked up here in the carport. I gotta get some tarps for it. Cause I tell you what, y'all, they're talking about us getting some really nasty weather coming in. Uh, not necessarily possibility of some snow, ice, some kind of mess, but the big thing that's got me concerned is is uh, what they're talking about with the chip or with chips. Thing about having put chips in the bird cages. Uh, what well, they're talking about having uh, the cold, cold weather. Uh, some, some with the wind chill. Maggie, Maggie, stop. Leave Lambo alone. Uh, the wind chills, they're talking about maybe even being the negative figures. And y'all, that's, I don't know, I would say that's cold in the south, but that is cold. To me, that's just about cold anywhere. So, Maggie, will you leave Lambo alone? So it, uh, yeah. So we're trying to get the wood ready to go, get the wood stove fired up. Um, while we're talking about heat, uh, that Hennessy, everybody you say that name of that heat and air unit, is doing a really good job, y'all. We've, we've been doing, getting down in the 20s. And uh, Maggie, I said stop, leave Lambo alone. Nothing around gets any rest with, Lam with Maggie. Other thing I've got to do today still, I've got to go get feed. I am completely out of the wild game uh, grower feed. And my diesel truck is not cranking because I guess it's a little bit cold. Could be three or four things wrong with that, that but oh well. That's just the way it goes. So I want to give y'all an update. I'll probably, I may show you a little bit what's going on. I'm going to be unloading that, but just look and GoPro battery is it's dead. I'm going to have to charge it up. All right, y'all, what I'm doing is I've been bringing it up here with the tractor and loading it here on the carport. And that's what we're trying, Maggie and I are trying to do. Load it here, load it in the carport.
Hey, what we're doing here is trying to get some mulch down to keep kind of a barrier in between the cold ground and also any mud and water that might have been there. That ended up working out pretty good. My only thing, when I built those doors uh, to those coops, I wish I'd made them wide enough to where that wagon would go in there and just dump. But those crazy turkeys, they're so skittish. Uh, they was flying around. Fortunately, none of them got hurt. It was a little bit aggravating, but uh, it would have been a lot easier if that wagon would go inside there. Uh, this coming year, we're going to be building some new coops, and those I'm going to have where a tractor can just dump in uh, shavings and stuff, make it a whole lot better than what it is now. Probably should have thought of this before. They turkeys are a very, very, very skittish bird. There you go, y'all. Try that. Maybe that'll help. I don't know.
Or did you just bring them down here? I throw them down. Let me go get another one, put back here. Mm. Let me get another one, put back here. Here's one that's not quite so long. Where are they at? We had them. Huh? Let me get zip ties. Okay. You know what? Though? So, what? I could put that wood on the inside there and you drill screws through it. Let me poke it back hope too to you. You want me to? Let me poke it back through to you. Okay. Wouldn't it have been easier to poke it through that hole right there? I'm gonna poke it through that hole right here. And then we'll go up under and grab that loop. That way I don't get a whole lot of holes in the plastic. Where's the hole at? It looks like it would have done better though. Where's the hole at that I need to come back? Right there. Straight <laughs> up there. Pull it right up here? Bit. Yeah, pull it up where that'll go. Like that. There you go. Oh, pass it. Mike, get out of there. Huh? You see what I'm doing? Mm -hmm. That way we only get one hole in the plastic. Might want to reuse it, right? Right. I don't have to reuse it. Where things are going. Good cost, yeah. I'm gonna have to cut this part. I don't really cut the part, you know? No, I don't think I cut the part. Well, it'll stay down, won't you? Yeah, I believe, I believe so. Huh? I believe so. Turkeys, if you're doing turkeys, you don't know when to wake up. Mm -hmm. You. Wind's gonna be quite coming out of the north. You know? Yeah. Alright, y'all. You guys are next. So if it's 12 I don't know feet. that I wouldn't pull this over here though and try to connect it where you can where the wind won't catch it and pull it. Well, you might have to see what that's reading will do. Huh? What still that? Huh? What sealed up? Turkeys. They got that, all that manure in there. They've got to have some air. They don't have some air right there and to the bottom over here. We don't have it sealed down over here. Uh, we need to redo all these coops and make them super duper nice. Um, we'll probably do like runners. No, we'll eventually have them all lined up down through here. These coops, we're going to build two more of these. And then we're gonna build four turkey coops and eventually we'll have all this fenced in. The geese will have them a pond right there where they where they was up. Yeah, there's some air to get in there. I mean we want some air to get in there all the time. Yeah. I think, yeah. All right, so you wanna put one of these at the bottom right here for when this blows up? That might be good. You know, just kind of Put one of those pieces of wood there and hold that down. Maggie can't stand it because she can't see in there. I get it mainly back here, maybe some up there. I guess that'll work. Oh. 
All right, Maggie's ready to go out. Y'all. Yeah. Got one chicken didn't go up last night. That chicken better get up tonight or tomorrow. It ain't gonna be good on it. Oh, there's two chickens. I see another one back here. I am not gonna worry about it. All the rest of them went up. Looks like. All right, man. All right. We're gonna do some chores and we're gonna try to finish up. Man, it's a raining out here. I don't know it's raining. And then we gotta finish up putting that plastic around the, the old cookie with us. Getting ready. Getting ready for the Arctic blast. To move in, better shut that door there. I'll have the chickens in there. Gotta get ready for the Arctic blast. I covered my hydrant up yesterday. I don't know why I was thinking. Oh my god. It's too much to do. Alright, Maggie now we're back. It got dark on us last night, so we had to kind of quit the the plastic thing. But you can see, we did get plastic on them. Uh, got tarps. And everybody ready to go. We got shade. Ooh, that ain't a good thing. Didn't get that door shut. Yeah. There you go, y'all. food right now I gotta give them some water I think the water's about full make get out of there and oh my y'all uh, We're gonna go down here. We met to last night. Get the promise of water. Guess what? Hey, here I am having to uh, fix the water. I knew it wouldn't last through the cold weather, but at least it gives some water before uh, the cold weather got there. This is just another example of destructive Brahma chickens. They, I'm, I'm telling you, they're rough on everything, even each other. Hey, y'all. I want to show you uh, kind of what we've done, how it's working, because, uh, man, it's, it's, it is definitely cold here. I don't even know if this camera's going to work right or not. But you've seen in uh, what we showed you so far, what we did to prep to get ready. Uh, this is Friday, the day of this cold weather. It's a high of 16 degrees here, wind chill, somewhere I don't, somewhere around zero or less. But uh, it, it, it is crazy. My only shot been coming out here. My automatic waters, they're not working at all, which I didn't expect that. Too hard. But, uh, Whew, let me just give y'all an update where the animals are. Let me turn this camera around. 
I said I wasn't too worried about the old geeseys. Old geese, they uh, they doing they doing pretty good. Uh, they're doing all right. Their water's froze. I get a stick. Stick won't bear my foot. <coughs> Mike, where's stick? <coughs> Let's take water hose. <coughs> I'll press that water up a little bit. <coughs> that right there gets pretty solid. But, can I tell you how warm it is in here anyway? Let's keep the north wind out of here. I need to come up there and staple that. Well, that'll be off there, probably. Right, I got those covered up well. But, let me show you what I've been doing with the uh, waters. Yeah, I said Brahmas. Being Brahmas. They've knocked their water, but I've been down there two or three times to feel that for them. Uh, they just being goofy Brahmas. Whereas Americanas, they still got their water. Look at that. Very good chickens. Really, really good chickens, y'all. Hey, run up here. We'll take a look at the turkeys real quick. The cats, I fed them, cleaned their litter box, and they are not coming out of the building. Whew, I don't blame them. Turkeys here doing okay. Cane. I don't know what's going in Cane. He just wants to get out here and hit Maggie. I have to watch him when I open the door. See, they're hanging in there. there watch this. Open door up. Can't be coming out the door. Who hey, look at? Oh no, I see Maggie. He's there. I'm gonna get him another water pan. They busted their water pan. What are you doing, Mom Turkey? How much y'all? This is an actual time. All right, y'all, this video's an actual time. It's about how long I've been out here. And it is, it is cold. Everything's doing good. This is Friday. We got about another day of this cold weather. And uh, have this thing behind us. This is, this is a mess. All right, hope everybody has a Merry Christmas. I know this is coming out on Christmas Eve. And apologize about not getting a video out this week. It has been busy around here with all the all the chores and getting these birds ready for this cold weather we had to put uh you know what you've seen in this video you saw us putting all these tarps and everything around the bird cages so it's been crazy and then i've gotten some kind of crud uh cold or something and uh so i don't know it's uh whew, it is crazy here crazy cold crazy cold but again we appreciate each and every one of you for watching the videos. If you hadn't subscribed, please subscribe. We're gonna have a lot of stuff going on. I just ordered a lot of materials from the Lowe's. As I always say, y'all, good place to work and good place to buy stuff. Uh, so I'll be getting that first of the year. That's gonna be going on the old house here. We are gonna keep working on the Vista. I'm gonna work on it little by little. Uh, probably not gonna have one this week because I'm gonna be working outside on it and it's just too cold to be working outside. Our next thing is gonna be taking that bumper off and getting that old tailgate off the back of it. And then our next step be working on that uh, quarter panel. But uh, again, y'all can't tell you enough how much we appreciate y'all and uh, each and every one of you. We never would have thought we'd even been up this many views or subscribers. And again, y'all, thank you for watching. Oh yeah, wanted to show y'all. I am running that fireplace and it's uh, it inserts doing a good job. I bought that thing off Facebook Marketplace used. Uh, not sure which kind, what kind it is. I, it, but any of you do know, you can put in the comments what you think it is. But uh, doing a great job, doing a really good job. Again, I really appreciate uh, Doug helping me cut that wood and, and get us some wood ready to go.